Good morning everyone, it's May here. I just woke up and I'm ready to try a new product today. In the winter time, I have been feeling my skin is a little bit more dry than usual and that's pretty common in this cold weather. Even though I'm exfoliating properly, sometimes I feel like my makeup doesn't sit that well in the morning and especially if I've if I'm going to do a full face, I want my makeup to look flawless. So I spend a lot of time moisturizing my skin in the morning as well. And so I was pretty happy when I found out It Too Taos has come out with a new skincare line. And that is the 3 Minute Care line. So I have 3 products of the line here. I have these sheet masks and it's the 3 Minute Care Mask in Black Bean and in the turmeric version and then I also have the 3 minute care pack in shower I'm going to try the sheet mask today but please let me know in the comments if you would like to see the in shower pack review as well and I'll try my best to make that happen so the 3 minute care mask I'm going to try today is the turmeric version I was doubting between the black bean and this one first I honestly thought this was going to be red bean then I would 100% chosen this because red bean is my favorite in desserts and it's not really that common in skincare but yeah I'm going to for I'm going for the turmeric one today because as you can see I had a little bit of a breakout and I had a pimple here which I accidentally scabbed with my nail so because this has turmeric I assume it's pretty it's pretty brightening it will hopefully help to relieve some of that redness here and maybe do some a little bit of scar treatment now I know this mask is supposed to be left on only for three minutes and that's what makes it very suitable for use in the morning as well because then you can just pop this on brush your teeth brush your hair and then after three minutes you can take it off wait for it to soak in maybe while you get changed and then you can apply your makeup and I have a feeling this would sit really well on the makeup but I really applaud it to the house for bringing out such an it's quite an unusual range it is inspired by the otoki curry packs i believe if i'm saying that well but it's giving me kind of that kudetama feel I'm, I'm not sure if it's because of the yellow and all but please let me know if you think if you got some kind of kudetama vibes of this one as well so yeah let's open this I just washed my face and applied toner and I wash my face as I usually do in the morning I just rinse my face with cold water and then apply the Sunjeng whip cleanser and as you can see I don't know if you notice something different but I got less I got lash extensions now so I need to cleanse a little bit more carefully but I like to use one of those microfiber uh, washcloths which really helps to make sure I exfoliate my skin gently while also removing my cleanser and the water more carefully from my from my face so if you have lash extensions that might be worth a try so let's open this one and see what it looks like oh my god <laughs> did you people saw the squirt of of lotion of essence that was coming out my god <gasps> my god it's so yellow I assume it's so yellow because of the turmeric but I know in a lot of maybe Indian skincare they use a lot of turmeric and I know turmeric is well known for its brightening properties but it's not something that we see usually in Korean skincare so I really like that they use this 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 ingredient for the sheet mask so this is what it looks like oh my god so let me apply I'm 
Wanna be a good doing said I'm there again that just in a jack to cap The fifth is pretty good. Okay, now let's set the timer for three minutes. Okay, so here we go. Okay, so, alright, so three minutes is up, so I'm going to remove the mask. Mm. My skin feels quite nourished and moisturized. However, I don't feel like there's a huge amount of essence sitting on top of my skin. So I think this will soak in pretty quickly, which I think is a good thing, especially if you're using this in the morning time and want to apply your makeup, your makeup afterwards. You don't want to wait too long in between for your essence to settle in so that you can apply your makeup quickly afterwards. I feel like I'm going to wait a couple minutes and wait for this to settle a little bit into my skin and then I'm going to choose whether I'm going to apply a cream or not and just apply my base makeup afterwards. So yeah. Okay, to be honest, this only took like 5 minutes or so to soak in and my skin feels really nourished, moisturized and it looks pretty calm as well. It didn't do much for my blemishes but honestly what can you expect in like three minutes however i do feel that my skin looks really a bit more brightened than before maybe that's just a placebo effect but i really feel like my skin looks calm moisturized and soothed and that's exactly what i need as a base for my makeup so to be honest i'm pretty pleasantly surprised i think this is a really great mask and i really like this new new style of skincare line from a to house i think it's really cute but not in like a pinky everything pastel kind of cute way that's that a to house is usually known for so i really like this style they are taking and i think it's really cute at the same time so yeah i would recommend this mask definitely i feel like three minutes is really all you need for this mask there isn't a huge amount of essence which makes it pretty easy for your skin to absorb it afterwards but your skin does feel really moisturized and if i had to compare it to like a usual 10 to 15 minute sheet mask i feel like this works pretty fine as well my skin is equally as moisturized as it would be from one of my favorite 10 to 15 minute sheet masks so if you're looking for something easy and fast to use in the morning i would highly recommend this mask so please let me know if you enjoyed this video and if you did might be a good idea to subscribe to my channel as well let me know if you tried any of these products before and what you think of them in the comments i wonder if i should use this one as well i think it looks pretty cute and um, it contains calendula which i really like as a skincare ingredient so let me know if i should try this or not and i'll see you in the next one bye